Hi, you're watching the Trucker Rudy Show. He's a good friend of ours. Please like, share, and subscribe just like we did. And I like chicken. <laughs> Good morning, good morning, guys. Yeah, we're in uh, Fargo, North Dakota, and uh, we just stopped in here for a breakfast break. So I figured out, go inside, go get me a uh, breakfast done. I know it's a little windy out here today, so right now I'm a little bit kind of in between the tractors here, so you don't really hear the wind, but yeah, truck stop is pretty full yet. But it's also early in the morning, right? So, I mean, the sun just really, literally just came up here a few minutes ago. So, yeah, we're going to go over there. We're at the uh, stay mark over here in uh, Fargo, North Dakota. So let's go ahead and go inside and let's grab us a bite to eat. Here we go, guys. That's how I look. Look at that. We got us some omelet here and a good cup of coffee. So we're gonna have us a good breakfast. It's time to leave Fargo, North Dakota, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, we had us a good breakfast there, and uh, now it's time to go home, sweet home. On this road for 150 yeah, miles. we had to clean our window there this morning. There at the uh, stay mark there. Or this morning we had a little bit of rain and then uh, after that we had uh, quite a few bugs so I just had to clean it you know had to clean the bugs off of the windshield so you guys get to see something through the windshield right that's always the idea right so that way we don't have all kinds of stuff in front of the camera lens and you guys can see properly through the window and that makes it a nice clear picture, right? At least that's always been the goal of mine. I like to have a good quality video. I don't really care for quantity. I, qu I care more for quality video. No, my talking might not always be quality, but hey, the video I like to have really good quality. But yeah. Here we are, hammer down. We got us another 234 miles to go to Winnipeg to our terminal. Then we'll drop this load off and then we'll see what we do from there. But I'm pretty sure we're just going to go home from there. But Well, that's basically what we are going to do. But I don't know if they're going to have a load from there for me to bring back or if they want me to bring back an empty trailer or if they just want me to bobtail back, right? <clears throat> I haven't heard anything from this patch yet. But, but yeah, another beautiful sunny day today. Although we did have a little bit of a breeze there, but it felt like it was coming southeast or something like that. So should be coming from behind us now since we're going north or sort of from behind us. So we should be good in that department. Should be getting good fuel mileage now. And it looks like we are. Although I can't complain, uh, this last tank of fuel I did over 7 miles to, to the gallon US. So that's pretty darn good I would say. I can't complain. But yeah, let's go home. Here we are back in Canada, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Manitoba. Where we have the roughest road on the planet. <laughs> no, that ain't the case, but... Uh, Hey, we got pretty darn rough roads up here on US, uh, on the US, US. <laughs> I'm still in the US, and but, but, but my mind. <laughs> Highway 75, that's basically all you can say. It's not US or anything like that. It's just Highway 75. That's it. But yeah, they got pretty darn rough roads here. That is a fact. And there we go. We got, got the fact in there again, yeah. <laughs> well, we gotta get it in every once in a while, don't we? I would think so. But yeah, we've been putting the hammer down, 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 and more down. Yeah, I'm just giving her today. I'm gonna get down to Winnipeg and then uh, go 
go ahead and drop my trailer and then uh, I still haven't heard from dispatch yet see what they want me to do if they want me to pick up an empty there or what but uh, I'll be sending them a message here later on and find out what they want see if they got anything from there to bring back to the yard or exactly what they have in mind but yeah we're getting closer to Morris right now yeah, but now we're just going to go straight to Winnipeg Terminal and drop this load and, Speed limit reduced to and then we got some plans to uh, go meet up with somebody yeah that's a for sure we're actually going to be meeting up with another YouTuber if uh, if everything will work out. So, so we'll see how that goes. But here we are, coming up to Morris, Manitoba. I have just finished dropping my trailer at the terminal, and now we're going down some back roads here towards my buddy's place. So we're going to see if we can find it. We got to make sure we can go on truck roads, though. And this one still says it's a truck road, so that's good. We're going to try and make our way towards this place and see if we can find it. Hopefully we uh, <laughs> can make it there, you know. So, anyways, we'll uh, see you guys later. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we're here at Mr. Dry Chef Drew. Who else would hey it guys? be, right? How are you doing? <laughs> and uh, he's got his whole, uh, whole board over here. It's, he's been showing us this famous uh, YouTuber board, eh? Yeah. yeah, that's what he says anyway. So here in a little bit, I think my card is going to be put up there too, right? Yes, it will be, Rudy. There you go. <laughs> By the way, guys, this is Truck Rudy. Ah! Just open the other screen, open this screen. That's all you got to do. <laughs> then all of a sudden he, go, he leaves the whole chat. <laughs> he's gone, eh? I haven't uh, introduced you guys to these guys here, so maybe you guys can introduce yourself because that would be a... Better idea because sure. I have Warm no idea. Time on the line. Time on the line. Yep. That's your YouTube channel name. Yep. All Just right. Tra trapping outdoors, whatever. Trapping Anything. Outdoor? Oh, nice, yeah. nice. And That'd this be... is Wild Swamp Donkey. I'm the Swamp Donkey 530. <laughs> All right. My channel is about uh, trapping and hunting and fishing. Good. Okay. And, uh, nice. That's what we do. What kind of uh, keep it wildlife you do oh. fish or? or I, I, I do a lot of ice fishing. I hunt deer right and moose so and elk yeah. and. Uh, yeah. Cool. Yeah, we do all sorts like of good stuff like on there. Well, I've never really had a, a <laughs> moose or anything like that. Is that like a cattle or how does that? No, it's much better. It's much very better? very lean meat. Yeah. And uh, it's better for you. <laughs> really? And it's way more it's fun to, to stop something that moves. To, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Listen to this guy. <laughs> but look at this, guys. We got the barbecue grill going here. And this is caribou? Yep, it's caribou meat. Nice. Look at that, guys. Let's get a close up on that. <laughs> <laughs> this camera has got a really wide angle, so. It yeah. looks like you're close, but you're really not on the I camera. I can't get over how small it is. Oh, yeah, it is a very small camera. Yeah? I've never seen one like that. No? Really? No, no. Yeah, they saw these at Best Buy. If you edit that, it'd be pretty funny. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, we're having us a good time, right? I've never seen one like that. <laughs> well, we got to get this on video. Sure. I love barbecuing myself, so oh, yeah. I do a lot of barbecue oh, videos oh, myself, oh, so oh, I usually go with beef ribs and stuff, so... Like Drew will probably out, tell you. Like, uh, there's another guy. <laughs> well, between all our videos, if everybody watches all the videos, they get just the gist of all of it. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You got to watch all four channels to find the whole story. Well, that's right. <laughs> and that might not even be the truth either. That's right. <laughs> you Nothing never know. Nothing but a bed of lies there. Yeah, you never know. <laughs> but no, we're... They gotta tune in to see if Swamp Donkey passed out on the floor or not. Yeah. <laughs> They'll be all over the place looking for it. Yeah. We'll have to sweep them up. Where's Swampy? <laughs> Where'd he go? Where'd he go? There he is. That wouldn't be the first time. No, I ain't very <laughs> I'm sure ain't gonna be the last. I know that. So. I remember waking up in the few garages. Yeah. And a few front yards. Yeah, few yeah when yards. I was younger, I woke up and put a few strange places. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I'm talking about last week, though. Not even once? No? 
Well, I, have to be. I can't. Uh, well, for some odd reason, my body doesn't allow me to drink that much. As soon yeah. as I drink a little bit, till I start spinning a little bit, and you quit. Uh, I puke. Oh, really? Oh, so I can't. Got it. I can't couple, drink. couple. But aren't we your freaking wussy? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Yeah, I, just, I can I can sit all day and drink because I just got to be careful I don't get yeah. to that point. You're just yeah. not a professional like yeah. us. Yeah, that's <laughs> it. I guess. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's... Yeah. Yeah. Saints yeah. are going, you know. Like, Norm, you don't drink, so... Yeah, the guys in the States all say that. How can you guys drink so much? We're Canadians, man. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's our profession. <laughs> well, you know, our we got to sit, yeah. sit in the garage all winter long, so what else are you supposed to do, oh, right? Exactly. <laughs> Winters are five months, oh, so what yeah, do you want us to do, you know? Yeah, yeah. Better yeah. <laughs> than putting the grill on and... But now with the smell of that, that's it, oh. it's time for a beer. <laughs> I concur. Yeah. Anybody else? Hmm? I wish I could. Go a fresh one. I don't touch it at all. No, I don't drink at all. Okay. Fresh. But I will have another. Yeah, you're, you're all in there. Rudy, you want another soap? Help yourself. Oh, we'll Let's have it in a minute. I'll join, I'll join you on the alcohol part today. <laughs> I hate to drink alone, but I will if I have to. <laughs> <laughs> That's one thing I honestly can say. The only time I ever drink alone is when I'm barbecuing. Yeah? Yeah, if I'm barbecuing, I have to have a beer. I don't well, know. the only time I ever drink is when I'm alone or with other people. So. <laughs> <laughs> There's no excuse not that one in your hand, as you say. <laughs> I guess when I drank, it was the same thing. <laughs> Gives a shit. I don't need an excuse to have a beer back then. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'll be honest. When I was drinking heavy, I didn't need it. excuse either. was wake up, oh, time for a beer. Yeah. <laughs> as long as there is one and it's cold, right? No, the, only play, the only time I didn't drink was when I was fishing and I was guiding. Oh, okay. Like the, the customers were free. They, like, they can bring all the beer in the boat they want. You're not supposed to. No. But it, that was a gray area of the rule book, okay. and I never did, just because cause I was a captain, right? Mm -hmm. And so you don't do that. That, no. that was my own. I could have very easily, but that was my own rule, and I just stuck to it. Right? Yeah. yeah, That's a good rule. Yeah, man. that is a good you rule. you got to have some rules. That's everybody got to have some rules. I'll be honest but with you. If I know I'm going to be driving, I won't drink. No, I, I refuse to. Yeah. Like, even if it's just to get my car and go to the store for, for more beer, no. Yeah. I yeah. won't do it. Yeah. Once I open a beer, I stay home. I know. That's the end of it. Yeah, or no, I, if I'm, let's say, at your place and we have three, four beer together, I'll stay at least two hours after before I even think about driving. Oh, home. yeah, exactly. Yeah. You know. No, I, I'm lucky that way. My wife has license too, and then she yeah. can drive home. And yeah, that's good then that way, yeah. Yeah, that's really now, in your career, you got to be very careful, too. Oh, shit, yeah, yeah. you got a sleeper on your truck. Yeah. You could just take a little nap. <laughs> well, there, yeah. 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 But well, you know what? He gets work. caught even with alcohol <laughs> on his breath. He's gone. Oh, yeah. That's, that's just such part. a strict rule. Oh, yeah. 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 Especially in the U.S. Canada and being is not that quite as strict, yeah. but the U.S. is very strict. Right. In the U.S., U.S., you can't even be seen going to a truck with the, the, the can or anything. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Well, same with my company though. Yeah. During the week when I'm working, yeah. I cannot touch a drop of liquor. Yeah. No all way. Week, all week yeah. long. If they want, they can at any time. Could be a piss test. Yeah, any time without even yeah. without even considering it, they can say, "Hey, come on." Actually, last week they called me. Charlie. Did they? Yeah. 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 I was just about ready to hook up to my trailer, and they called me and they asked if I had a hot load or if I had time. And I said, "Well, if you can ask the dispatch." I said, "I don't really care." Whatever, you want to do a piss test, that's okay with me. But So they called the dispatch and said, no, he's got to be there at the time. So I hmm. didn't have to go last week. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah that's the way it is. But right? yeah, it's just it's like in our, in our industry, because I'm a truck mechanic and he's a truck driver, yeah. in our industry, that's the way it is. Yeah. During the weekend on your own time off, do what you want. Yeah. But come the day you're coming back to work, yeah. you better have been at least 24 hours while even having a drink. And they can, you, they're going to tell. Yeah, yeah, because oh, yeah. you can walk in on a, on a, on a say, a Monday morning or whatever, mm -hmm. you'll walk into work and they can say, hey, you pissed that now, go. That's all. You're on company like time, go. Yeah. And it's like, yeah. oh, I've been drinking, but I don't care. Yeah. You know, go for your, go now. Well, then they say, they, you they want to refuse it or what? You know? Oh, you can. Yeah. You can. You, you can, can refuse it. it, they park you immediately. But it's an automatic write-up if you do oh, it, right? Yeah. That's what I mean. Like, you can refuse yeah. it, but then it's, it's a hit on your... It's right? a hit on your... It goes against you then. Yeah. 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 So you know, better safe than sorry. Just don't do it. You can't. You can't think around with your livelihood. 
That's right. That's just, there's no two ways about it. Or you can, but you're not going to go for it. Yeah. Well, that's the thing with my driver's license. I don't think around with it. I mean, there's no way I'm going to play games like that. I mean, I know some people who will drink uh, two dozen beers, jump behind the wheel, and drive away. Oh, that's no. To me, that's just If if I've had three beers and I run out of beer, yeah, I got a beer store about half, half a mile from my house, taking the back way, parking in the uh, Sobe parking lot and walking over. I'll do that. Yeah, but you know what? You get pulled over, you that they'll have, they'll have a block to buy a license. I know. Well, but it's I, your you chance. Know, I know. I I take chances. Or if you hit a little kid, pays walk, your money, it takes your you chances. Do. You know. Oh, it is. It yeah, is you got to be careful, man. That's that's. No, I'm just saying, saying what I what I've done that. Right? Yeah. Yeah. What I've done in the past, and I'm kind of inclined. So yeah. <laughs> well, that's, yeah, that's up to you, but I mean... It is, yeah, it really is. Your life, I mean, that's it what is. I look at it. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. yeah. Well, I gotta try and do the right thing if I can. It doesn't always work out. Norman's just starving today. He is. <laughs> He's gotta feed the machine every day. <laughs> <laughs> Have you never watched any of his vids? <laughs> How's that go, Lord? I'm too sexy for my bud. <laughs> no. Look at this, guys. They got this all ready to eat, eh? Look at all these goodies they, these guys got up here. Look at these guys, they just dig in, right? <laughs> yeah, go for it, man. You gotta tell me twice. <laughs> no shit, eh? All right, we're gonna have us a good bite to eat. Okay, I guess Rudy's getting ready to roll. Yeah, we're getting ready to roll out of here. So, so uh, let's do this official. Official, thank you. <laughs> nice meeting you guys. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you, yeah. Rudy. So any uh, last words you guys want to say? Not at all. Not at all? I'm too full, I'm too full to stand up. <laughs> <laughs> Just get out of my grad, right? <laughs> I'll, I'll officially say it. Everybody, y'all better watch uh, Trucker Rudy's channel because he's got some good stuff. Coming. Hey, go check those guys out too. I think Drew is going to get me uh, in touch with your guys' link if I don't remember exactly yeah. what they're called. I mean, yeah, I should have it on video, yeah, but that's right. yeah, I'm terrible with spelling. I, well, you'll figure it out. <laughs> if you guys subscribe to me, I'll find you that's guys. That's what I'll do. I'll yeah. do that and I'll leave a comment on your yeah. channel. Then I'll that. be able to find you guys and then yeah. I'll get the Absolutely. I'll get the Never link rolled. from your channel. I'll leave them in yeah. the description down below sure. so yeah. everybody can check you guys out as so well. We're do again, or like yeah, that would be nice. First yeah, well, do it again for sure, for sure. Yeah, maybe one of these days we can get down here with the family and can, yeah. or whatever. Or down to your place or whatever. Or yeah. Or beach or wherever. Yeah. 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 Or maybe awesome. you meet the park or something. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, who knows? Yeah, I don't know. But I well, want to try your ribs one of these. Days. Yeah, <laughs> everybody does say that they like to try my ribs oh, one of these days. But you know, I was going to go down to the truck show this week, but yeah, it didn't true. happen. So yeah, but yeah. I guess you're off and running, or are you off for a couple of days now? Or yeah, I'll be off till Tuesday at least. So we'll see what happens there. But anyways, goodbye everybody. And uh, we'll uh, talk with you guys later. Here we go, hammer down, hammer down, going home sweet home. Appreciate you guys all meeting up with me today there at uh, Dry Chef Drew's uh, garage. We all had us a good time over there. I hope you guys enjoyed that little video clip there. And uh, hey, we will have to do that again, that's for sure. That's a nice little barbecue there he threw together there. And caribou, I've never had, never had caribou before. And I honestly gotta say it was good. It was very good actually. Well yeah, here we go, hammer down. We'll go home and get ready, go back to Winnipeg again. <laughs> we actually got invited to a friend's place there for dinner, so yeah, probably won't be able to eat much tonight, but <laughs> yeah, well we'll go over there and have a good time at our friend anyways. So we'll uh, we'll see what else we will be able to show you today. Might be able to show you another barbecue today. We just might be able to do that. Hey guys, do you guys see the smoke? Yeah, we're over here at my buddy's place in Winnipeg. And look at that, he's even wearing a Trucker Rudy shirt. Can you believe that? Oh my. And look at this beef ribs that we got over here. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Yeah. We're going to have us a good barbecue. Like we had one earlier already today, but we're going to have us another one, right? Yeah, I better close that before it burns. <laughs> <laughs> We're having a good time having a cold beer, right? Oh yeah. Well guys, it looks like we are eating some dinner. Looks like really, really good, I would say. Oh, so let's get to eating. It's time to get going. It's time to move on. 
put this behind me. <laughs> 